Hi and how are you all today? Let us proceed on with the question which is given to us. It says in a survey it was found that 21 people like product A, 26 like product B and 29 liked product C. If 14 people liked product A and B, 12 people liked product C and A, 14 people liked product B and C and 8 liked all the three products, find how many liked product C only. So let us start with our solution by first of all let A denote the set of people who like product A. Therefore, we denote the set of people who liked product B and C denote the set of people who liked product C. Right. Now, here in the question, we are given that Number of people who liked product A are given to us as 21. Number of people who like product B are given to us as 26. Number of people who like product C are given to us as 29 in the question. Right. Now, number of people who liked product A and B is given to us as 14 number of people liking product A and C are given to us as 12 whereas number of people who like product B and C is given to us as 14 then one more thing number of people liking product A, B and C is given to us as 8 so can we find Number of people who like product C only. Yes, we can. It will be. Now, let us draw a Venn diagram which will represent this information. Let this be product A. this be product B and this be product C. Right. Now, let us name the elements. Let the elements E, B, C, D are there in set A. B, C, E, F are there in set B and G, D, C, E, B in product in set C. Right. Now here, number of elements A are having are A plus B plus C plus D. Whereas in B, we have B plus C plus E plus F. Whereas in C, we have D plus E plus C plus G. Right. Now, further, in A intersection B, which are the elements that we are having? It is B and C, which is common to both A and B. Right. So, it is B plus C. Here it is C plus E. Here it is C plus T and here it is C plus E. And this is represented by only one element that is common to all of them that is C. Now, here by substituting the value of C in these three equations, we can get the value of B, T and E. So, that will be.
substituting the value of C in three areas we have 8 plus D as 12, 8 plus E as 14 and 8 plus P as 14. So let us find out the value of T. That will be 4. The value of E will be 16. And the value of P will also be not 16. It will be 6. And value of P will also be 6. Now, we need to find the number of people in group C only, that means we need to find the numerical value of G. So, we have the value of D, we have the value of E and we have the value of C. So, substituting the value in this equation, we will get the value of G and that will be our answer, right? So, we have D plus C plus E plus G equals 29. Let us substitute. 4 plus 8 plus 6 plus G is equal to 29. That gives us the value of G as 11. So therefore, number of people who like only product C, that is the value of G, that is 11, right? So this completes the entire question that was given to us. I hope you enjoyed the session and, and by drawing this Venn diagram and having some elements forming them into equation helped you in arriving your answer. So I hope you understood the question and the procedure to be followed. Bye for now.